welcome back to another mod installation tutorial. Today we are looking at the furniture mod. It's a little bit different than a mod that I played with a while ago. I never did make a video about it because it kept crashing. So here is a different one and I think I like this one better. So on the forum page, which I will post the link below, it will come up like this furniture mod about screenshots. I love the way they have this forum page laid out because it's very easy to find what you're looking for. So installation. Big letters hard to miss. You need mod loader and mod loader MP. Both of them you download, you extract, you put the class files into the jar file. Well that's server but still the dot jar file. And if you aren't sure about how to do that the mod loader installation video is an old one but it installs the same way no matter what update version it is so you don't really have to worry about it this is still 1.2.5 it hasn't been updated yet and none of my survival LPs etc have been updated either so that's why some of these mods I'm showing you are still older ones but I will eventually be <laughs> reviewing some new mods so step 2 download client or server uh, by clicking here put that in your mods folder so obviously it's very simple it only requires a couple things, and then you just place it in your mods folder. And then here are all the recipes. So I won't be able to show you guys all the recipes, because I don't think I'll remember them all. Come time to do the review, but that is how how a lot of these work. And there's some other reviews that people have done um, as well. And copyright, etc if you want to donate and then everyone's information so I'm going to get rid of that so here's the mod so because I already have mod loader and mod loader MP installed which I know you guys like seeing it step by step but as soon as the mods get updated and I can move into 1.3.2 then I will make new installation tutorials showing you step by step including mod loader, mod loader MP GUI and all that other kind of stuff. So, take that. I'm going to cut it and paste it into my mods folder with all my other fancy mods. It works with Atmos mobs, Mo creatures, Simply Horses. I haven't found any ID issues yet, but that doesn't mean there isn't. So, then you just want to go into Minecraft and you want to test that to make sure it's not going to crash on you. Okay, so we want to go into I'm just gonna go to the simply horses one for now. Oops. Okay, you just want to check your inventory. Git oh, my way. And here we are. So under the simply horses, under the Atmos mobs we have all these here. And actually, now that I'm looking at it, you are missing some at most mobs items. You don't have the chameleon egg. And it looks like we are also missing a couple of the fish, but I won't, I'm not entirely sure. So, uh, to fix that, and to fix the issues we've had with the spawn lasso and the sugar cube is when it comes to Atmos mobs because that's supposed to be a fish or frog leg and something else. Uh, there's an ID resolver mod which also works. I am in the midst of getting it sorted out for you, but right now it's not working quite right. So when I get it sorted out, I will show you guys how to install it, and that will be that because that's kind of what this stuff is in the corner. So I will catch you guys later with the review.